Welcome! In front of me I have Samsung Galaxy Watch 5 and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the Android phone. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with a phone via the Galaxy wearable application. Also, I'm pretty sure if you're not wearing your watch, for example, if it's on the table or something, and you won't be able to receive the notifications on your watch. You need to be wearing it uh, to receive the notifications. Okay, now let's continue with the video. So, uh, first, let's open the Galaxy wearable application on the phone that is paired with our watch. Once you open the application, you should see the device page for your watch. On this page, tap on the watch settings and here tap on notifications. If you don't have required permissions allowed for the applications or application to send the notifications to our watch, you will get the pop-up. You need to tap on allow and this will redirect you, for example, to the notification access. I'm gonna tap on Galaxy Watch 5 Manager, tap on allow, tap on allow, and then we can go back to the app by tapping on the uh, back button. And once you allow the uh, required permissions, you can customize your uh, notification settings. And we can tap on show phone notifications on watch. And here we can select to show the alerts when phone is not in use. So basically, if the screen on the phone is uh, turned off, you will be able to receive the notifications on your watch. And the second option is show alerts even when phone is in use. So if the screen is uh, active on your phone, it's you still will you still will receive the notifications on your watch. Also, like I said before, apparently you won't get phone notifications on your watch when you're not wearing it. So you need to be wearing the watch, the watch rather, to receive the notifications. Okay, I'm gonna select this option and then go back. Next, we have the option to mute the notifications on phone. So basically, if you select this option, you will receive the notifications on your watch, but the notifications on the phone will be muted. And below that we have the list of apps and we can enable or disable the notifications for the apps on your phone. And you can tap on more to open the uh, list of apps. You have the most recent apps on phone. You can also tap on this uh, menu here and you can uh, select most frequent on phone or watch, allowed on watch, blocked on watch and all. If you select all you can enable the uh, notifications for all the apps on your phone. You can select the locked on the watch list to enable it and stuff like that. So find the apps you want to receive the notifications from on your watch, enable the notifications for them. And once you're done, you can also tap on advanced notification settings. And here you can uh, enable or disable a couple more, more things like notification indicator. So basically, if, if this option is enabled, it will show you the indicator on the watch face that you have unread notifications. Next, we have the uh, read notifications allowed. And if you, if you enable this option, it will read the notifications allowed if you have the headphones connected, for example, to your watch. Uh, and apparently it won't work if the headphones are not connected. So you need to have the headphones connected to your watch for this feature to work. Next, we have a show of details. So basically it will uh, show the a notification with the details automatically. If you disable this option, it won't show the de details. And the, then we have the turn on screen. So if you enable this option and you receive the notifications on your watch, it will turn on the screen. And last is the turn off for new apps or turn on for new apps. So basically, um, if you enable this option and you install new apps on your phone, it will automatically enable the notifications for them when you install them. So if you don't want to go back to app and check them, or rather enable it uh, every time you install the new app, you can select this option and it will be enabling them automatically. Okay. Now, uh, we should be able to receive notifications on our watch. So I'm gonna, uh, for example, place, place the finger under the sensor. Hopefully it will detect us wearing it. And then I'm gonna send myself a message on Discord and we should be able to receive it, receive it rather. And here we have it. We have the message on our phone and also on our watch. Here we have our, our message. We can also reply immediately. We can tap right here and reply. 
um, like this. And we can also scroll down, we can use the quick replies. And if you scroll to the bottom, you can tap on mark as red, mute one hour, show on phone and more. You can also swipe right to close it. And if you want to check the notifications you missed, you can swipe right on the home screen and here you should see the notifications. You can tap on them to reply, for example. You can, uh, I believe, uh, swipe right and then tap on clear all to dismiss them all. And that's about it. Oh no, you can also swipe up on the notification itself to only clear one. Okay. And that's how you enable the uh, phone notifications for this watch on the Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.